Oh, I'm so sad that Marshmallow got eliminated. I know, but don't worry. Knowing sell at these stupid speed, this will probably be all over soon. Yeah, I mean, this is kind of stupid. The junior line's basically broken up now. There's barely any members left. Speaking of which, what do you think the challenge is going to be today? Uh, I have something more important. Why did Gumbella just try to decide to leave? With toilet, no less. Yeah. Maybe it's something to do with the challenge today? That was yesterday, Flash Eye. And speaking of Celebi, has anyone seen him? Um, so guys, what do you think the challenge is going to be today? I don't know, but honestly, I'm just feeling so happy today. Why? Well, I don't think you've noticed, but it's been a lot less noisy. Like, a certain someone has been missing. Are you talking about Selby? Yes, now that you mention it, Selby has gone missing. Wait, what? Why didn't you tell us this? I just thought everyone noticed. Uh, let's tell the others. Hey guys, what's up? What's going on, dude? <laughs> Selby's gone missing. Wait, that's a little weird. We were actually going to tell you something. What? Um, it's something about, well, the fridge. Well, more like the food. It feels... It's like it's been restocked with actual food. Wait, what? Then hell yeah, let's get some! Uh, won't Selby get mad? Dude, that's the thing. Selby never actually buys food. He gives us gruel for breakfast. Well, at least not the winners, anyway. Uh, guys, do you think something's watching us? Dude, we're always being watched. There's a camera. How do you know? Bring the camera over to the mirror. Just go over to the mirror, fine. Oh, I guess there is a camera. Who's that? I'm, I'm the one voicing you, idiot. Get me off the thing. Oh. Oh, there we go. Alright, so what do you... Uh, let's just... Let's just look for Selby. Everyone split up all around the island. And a lot of things have been moved, so come on. Alright, we've been assigned to the kitchen, guys, so we need to look everywhere. Alright, so here's the plan. I'll look in the pantry. And... Oh my god! They were in line. There is actual food here. Focus. Uh, Alright, so here's the plan. Well, you guys take the laundry room, we'll take the actual kitchen, and Don, you can just t take that fridge and freeze it. Why? Steal some food, jeez. Alright, fine. There's nothing in here other than, like, the plates and sprinkles. Ooh, Kool-Aid. Level up achieved. Hmm, that's... Aw, uh, there's a lot of cooking materials here. <gasps> Damn, Salty's been hanging out on us, jeez. Even if there are green beans here. There's nothing in here. Morton, get out of there, you can hurt yourself. Okay, no, Morton, just close it. Close this before you break it. Let's go. There's nothing in here. Did you look everywhere? No, yeah. Yeah, he's not there. Yeah. I was about to check the fridge. I guess there is nothing. I guess we're good. Wait a minute. What about the freezer? Oh, um, okay. <gasps> Done? <laughs> Wait, what happened? Hold on. <gasps> oh, God. Oh my god! Dead body! This isn't Among Us, Morton. Oh! Uh, is he okay? What's in there? Selby's dead! Wait, what? Well, I can probably tell you one reason. He's in the freezer. He's a grass type. Uh, and oh, 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 crap, crap! God, this freaking knife. Um, well, obviously that's a murder weapon. Can you put that back? Uh, no, no, just lift it up and put him over there. All right, uh, Morton, come here. Uh, yeah, it's freaking cold. I'm not I told you to bring the body in the night, you idiot. All right, well, Don's fainting on the floor over there. I'll get it. His heart's freezing cold. So is his pulse. <laughs> well, she's going to continue fainting. All right, Morton, bring that to the bay. Let's go. The bay? I mean, the meeting area, whatever. So, is he really dead? Yes, he is. His pulse and his blood have stopped. Well, I think I... The first one to say this, I've always wanted to do this. Wait, what? Alright, goodbye. <laughs> Jazz! What? I'm not the only one who wanted to do that. Sure, sure, we all wanted to do that. But now, you just got rid of our evidence. Oh. 
Well, it's not like it's just gonna fall back out of the sky. <laughs> Are all the freaking shy characters just gonna fall and die? No, we're alive. We're just. Uh, I can't look. More importantly, who brought his body back? We did! Huh? Monica, sound off! Monotaro! Monosuke! Mono funny! Mono kid! Mono dumb! We are the Mono Cubs! What? Why are there Builder Bear rejects here? Oh, they're not Builder Bear rejects. They're my little servants. <gasps> Who are you? Me? <laughs> well, for now you can call me the Queen. The what? Did you not hear her? She said the Queen. Queen? Queen? What? I think the Queen did on the nervous. Yas Queen! You're probably wondering who my name is. My name is Junko Enoshima Ya Queen! Enoshi. Wait a minute. You're the person who keeps saying Sulpy those letters. Yep, and now, now I only got 16 of you left in this stupid game. I have no need for this stupid body. And I also put stuffed them in the freezer just to obfuscate the cause of death. Oh, yeah, that's right. A, bo a dead body in f either freezing or high temperatures can mess with the state of the body. Yeah, so, whatever. Alright, so you're probably wondering, Oh my god, who's gonna be the host now that Shelby's dead? Duh! You realize we can just bring him back with one-ups or Max Revive. There, there's shit in this universe that works, you know that, right? Shut up! Alright, so, get these two up, please. Morin, please do that. I will. Alright, so you're probably gonna wonder why did I have to kill the host and why I'm keeping you guys alive. Well, simple. I'll have one, a chance for one of you to gain the million dollars right now. <laughs> oh, I like this host better. I think she's implying that we have to do something for it. Don't we always have to do something for these stupid million dollars? I'm talking about something bad. Simple. All you have to do is murder each other. All you have to do is murder each other, like I just said. Murder. <laughs> what? Um, murder each other? I think I like Silpy more at this time. Uh, I have a few complaints. I'm already dead. Stabbing, acupuncture, burning, gunshots, weapons, any form of murder. And... All you have to do is get away with it in a class trial. Class trial. Well, this is not a classroom. This is a freaking game show cast. Cast trial, class trial, whatever the hell it means. <laughs> so all you have to do is, you know, just pass the class trial. Why does she sound like some anime waifu now? Isn't she an anime waifu to begin with? Shut up. Mm, yes. All you have to do is just complete a class trial, get away with it, and the million dollars is yours. But. I will not say any more rules until the killing begins. So, yas queen! Come on, my little berries, let's go! So long, farewell! What? So, so, wait, why can't we just leave? I'm already on the. Oh, leaving is prohibited unless you want to immediately die. Um, I'm going back, Umga. Oh, did you also notice that she was like changing voices? Like, am I the only one who thinks it's annoying? So who do we kill? Megamine! What? Um, so... Um, ow. So let me get this straight. In order for us to win the million dollars, we have to just kill each other and get away with it? This is easier than other seasons. Psh, ow. Well, I think we should just, you know, uh, stay away from each other for now. Because I'm not hanging out with potential murderers. Excuse me? What do you mean by that? Well, for all we know, you can face through a wall, kill one of us, and leave no evidence behind. You idiot! Ghosts can kill, but they leave evidence behind as well. You know that, right, you idiot? <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna leave. Yeah, I'm actually agreeing with the turtle. I'm out of here. Yeah, I would like to trust all my friends here, but I don't want to get murdered. Yep, and I'm the easiest to murder, so goodbye! Yep, go on, come on. Uh, sure. Um, wait for me, balloon? Um, can I tackle? Oh.
Hey girl, you wanna come? Yes. I'm out of here. So am I. I'm leaving. <laughs> uh, how about we um have an alliance for now? An alliance? Yes, an alliance of don't kill each other. I like that alliance. Yep. Sounds good to me. Alright. It's almost nighttime anyway, so you know, we need to just go to sleep. So let's just go in our dorms for the night. And tomorrow, we'll have a new day, and we'll meet up here. If one of us is missing, that means we either murdered someone, or we've been murdered. Got it? Got it. Got it. Got it. All right, meeting adjourned. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Um, it's the next morning. Where's that? Where's some people? You're missing five people. Konta, Bula, Jazz, Megamine, and Bowser Jr. All right, guys. It's so, someone's probably been murdered. Um, everyone, look around. Um, how about this? Um, Boo, Morton, um, Don, you go look in the kitchen. We'll we'll look elsewhere. Come on, guys. Help me don't find out a dead body. All right, guys. We need to look everywhere. Yeah. No, leave no. Morton, what are you looking at? What's that? Don, get over here. Really? Did you find something? We might have. Come on. Hmm? What is that? It's probably just cherry Kool-Aid. Here, I'll take a little taste. That's blood. Wait, what? Wait, if this is blood... Th With the body. This might just be Celebi's blood, you know? No, it looks fresh, doesn't it? Yeah, it is wet, so that means it is fresh. I'm gonna try looking around more. And Selby was stabbed, not whatever this is. And blood didn't just come in a straight line like that. It's right next to. Oh God, please no! What's wrong, guys? No! What's wrong, guys? <gasps> not again! <laughs> Uh, body report! This isn't Among Us! Sorry. Morton, go round everyone up! Okay. Do we clean the blood? Uh, just get a wipe just in case. Morton, go get everyone still. Like a body has like been discovered! Should I clean this up? No, it's, it could be a, a crucial piece of evidence. So come on! Alright, I can't stand this blood here anymore. I'm gonna have to just clean that up. Just make a mental note of it, Don. Okay. It's true. He's dead. What killed him? Uh, I don't know. Well, we'll tell you that, huh? Ah! Ow! Idiots, I told you! Should I took the escalator? Shut up! Anyway, here is the monovile. Please take it. What is the monovile? It will explain everything you need to know for the class trial. Be wary, because you only have a few minutes before the class trial begins to gain evidence. So long, farewell! Hey, that's supposed to be my line. I was supposed to explain all that, but you know who gives a crap. So long, farewell, whatever, we're going. You have, you have ten minutes. Alright, let's, let's look up the cause of death. Well, you found him in the freezer, right? So obviously the cause of death was, a, was freaking cold-blooded. No. What? It says right here that the cause of death wasn't being cold-blooded. Well, actually, that was the cause of death, but it looks like there was a weapon in use. What? Well, it doesn't say there was a weapon, but it also says, look, it also shows his injuries. He has a blunt force in the head. That could explain why that, that big mark is there. Also, the blood was here. Don't you think that was Selby's blood? Wait a minute, where's Megamine? Over here, obviously. So, what do you mean? It says there was a blunt force to the head. With what weapon? I don't know. And the time of death is roughly around 3 p.m. 3 p.m.? Oh, sorry, I mean 3 a.m. Isn't that around the time we're all supposed to wake up? So it's Kurt. I knew it. His murder was very recent. Alright, so I guess that means we have all the evidence we need. Well, there could be more, but I just think we- Ten minutes isn't enough. <sighs> Rest in peace, Junior. Alright, everyone, let's go to the place where we meet. 
Let's go. Oh, bye. It's everyone, Mari. Oh, Let's like begin. Dun dun dun. All right. So, what do we do? Uh, like, basically, all you have to like do is. Wait, you didn't even explain the rules of these trials. Ugh, like, fine. All right, so like, listen up. All you have to do is collect the enough evidence and use that evidence in order to convict the blacken in this case, AKA the murderer of Junior. So basically, if you get it right, you all get to live and only the blacken gets eliminated. But if you get it wrong, all of you get eliminated and only the blacken gets the money. Simple and sweet. So, like, get on with it. I have shit to do later. All right, should we begin the argument? Yes, we should start off with the cause of death. <laughs> if I'm not mistaken, the cause of death was a blood force to the head, right? No, that's wrong. The cause of death was the freezer. Uh, wait, what? What do you mean it was the freezer? In the mono file, it said the cause of death was the freezer. The only, the reason why you would think it was a bond force of the head is because of, you know, the blood and the weapon in use, which we still don't know, and its injuries. So, the cause of, we can now confirm that the cause of death was indeed, you know, the freezer. Alright, then, who are our prime suspects? In fact, speaking of that, you're one of them, Bula. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's like my new favorite time. Prime suspect time! Model Cubs, get the, the suspect chairs. On it! There are four prime suspects in this case. Those four are Bula, Jazz, Konata, and... Hmm, who was it again? Oh yeah, Megamine. Ah! Oh, oh! Unga, oh my god, they're the suspects! What do you mean, we're the suspects? Yeah. Not only did you not have an alibi for that time, you were missing during the morning meeting, and you guys have peculiar ways of killing Junior with a blunt force of the head. I thought the cause of death was the freaking freezer. Uh, I mean, knocking him out. So unless you can prove your innocence, you will keep thinking you are the prime suspects. Damn yeah, yeah. How could I have killed Junior? I don't have any weapon. Yeah, I couldn't have killed Junior either. I mean, what could I have used as a weapon? Literally nothing. I'm not even gonna mention my weapon. I only use explosions as my weapons. That's not like I could have used to kill him. All right, we're getting over this. Tell us your alibis and what time you were with those alibis. Say your alibis now. I was in my room with Ben at the time. I can vouch for her. Then why was did Fang come but not Konita? Simple. She really, really wanted to finish this up in the video game we were playing. But since the morning announcement, she said to cover for her. So I did. Alright, I guess that provides her with a decent alibi. When was this? Uh, probably around the same time as the morning announcement, actually. I was totally, you know, in the bathroom. I was dropping a load. I'll cut through your lies. <laughs> really? Sorry. But that's a lie. I was with Bula the whole time. She wasn't alone. In fact, the, but the only time she was alone was when she went to go get something to eat in the kitchen. <gasps> what the fuck did you just say? He said me. Sut? I think what he's trying to say is sus. Dude, you have a serious speech impediment. I'm not lying. Hey! So we can remove Konata off the suspect list. Ah! Ooh, thanks, Dan. You're welcome. But, Bula, you're definitely a prime suspect. Alright, let's hear Jazz. We don't need to hear Jazz's. Isn't she the culprit? What? That gunk fell at the scene of the crime. Remember it? That had to be from her ink. No, that's wrong. That, that was obviously blood, right? So, obviously, it could have been jazz. You know what? Something did smell weird when we went into the kitchen, right, guys? Yeah, it smelled like cherries. The cherry Kool-Aid! What? Uh, 
You idiots. May I be excused for a minute? Fine. This. Huh? Wait, what? The cherry Kool-Aid. It looks and it smells just like it did in the kitchen. Didn't it? Yeah. And who investigated the kitchen? Myself, Megamine, Konita, and Morton. As well as Dawn. Well, uh, since Dawn fainted every time she saw blood, I don't think she would have the, the balls to do that. And as much as Morton would like, I think Morton would like to kill someone, yeah. he's too stupid. But the, this leaves another suspect. Not you, Chaka, right? No, not me. Megamine, you're still another prime suspect. Jazz, you're free. What? Ah, thank you. You two still don't, you know, your main suspects. Dad didn't explain their alibi. I was in my room because I didn't want to be bothered. Sounds like a strong alibi to me. Yeah, and I was in the play area. That's in the kitchen. They're still our prime suspects. Thank you for this new evidence, Sako. Great, now can I put this back? Because it's really starting to smell. Alright. And did you know something? The place of murder was never mentioned. So that means Junior wasn't even murdered in the kitchen. So that means my ass is off the hook. Are you sure about that? Because you would still have to bring him to the kitchen. How would I lift him, dumbass? So you two are still our prime suspects. So, should we put it to a vote? Wait, oh, it's voting time already? Wait, I think, I think maybe we should have a little debate. Now hold on. Debate? It's time for a scrum debate. What? Choose the side you want, and I'll split you off to debate the topic. It's Megamine. It's Bula. Um, do we? Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's just get there. Uh, okay, okay. Bula could have easily flowed through the walls from where Junior was and killed him. Pot taco. Don't booze. Booze can't take whatever they a human body through the walls with them. Boo. Junior's not an item, though. He is a human. But Bula was here in the kitchen at the time, right? Bula. I didn't say this before, but I only went to the kitchen for a quick snack, and that was around the ending time of the morning. Before we went to bed. I was way farther away from the kitchen than she was. Obviously, she's the culprit. I got this. But we don't know what time you were there. But doesn't the evidence support that Megabean isn't the culprit? Light bulb. I'm not the smartest I'm gonna, but... Isn't the evidence just how he died? We didn't even get enough evidence. This is our answer! It's decided. Megamine is the culprit. What? First of all, what would I even kill him with? Your wand. I don't use any. I didn't say you used a spell with your wand. I said you just used it. You bonked him on the head with it. Here's how the story played out. Here's how the, it went down. Junior must have went to the kitchen for some reason. But I thought we already decided that the crime wasn't occurred in the kitchen. It didn't, because he saw something in the playroom. Let's not forget, all of our rooms are intertwined within this stupid island. So, he must have been just doing a, a room inspection, in which he found a nice, cozy place. The culprit was, however, in there, and bonked them on the head with an object. This case, phew, his, their wand. Not killing him, he, the culprit picked them up, and in order to obfuscate the place of death, the culprit must, and the cause of death, the culprit must have just placed Junior in the fridge. And in order to fake the blood, the culprit squirted some red Kool-Aid on the floor. I get that about right! <laughs> The Crimson Demon Megamine. Ah! Oh! Ah, uh, like, ow! Not only are you totes right, you are definitely getting definitely pushed time. Oh, you are safe for now, ya queen. What? what? 
What happened to me? It's punishment time. What? The Crimson Demon Megami has been found guilty. Time for punishment. Beep, beep. And I put this on. Nine. 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 Beep. Beep. <laughs> oh. Like, that's it for today, everyone. See you next time on, like, Total Stuff with Island, Season 10, or in this case, Total Junko Island. <laughs> Yas Queen! So long, farewell!